Hey everybody, Mrs. Bodishan here. We are doing a bubble solution lab to see what solution makes the best bubble. I set up three pastry dishes and we put a little bit of Dawn liquid soap at the bottom of each one. I went ahead and made some bubble wands just using um, some pipe cleaners. And we are gonna go ahead and add a little bit of corn syrup to our pastry dish on the left, a little dollop, and then a little dollop of glycerin on our pastry dish on the right. The one that is in the middle will only have Dawn liquid soap. We're gonna go ahead and add some water into each one of these. Try to get the same amount of water in each one and then give it a really good stir. Once they're fully combined and dissolved throughout, you're gonna go ahead and put that bubble wand in. Make sure that you can let it drip a little bit and not have all that excess on there and then try to blow a bubble and see which one you think makes the best bubble. In fact, leave it in the comments. Which Petri dish or which solution do you think makes the very best bubble? So let's talk about this for a second. We have Dawn liquid soap, corn syrup, glycerin, and water. Which ones of these are gonna be the solute and which one is gonna be the solvent? These three dishes make solutions, right? So if we're talking about our Petri dish on the left with our corn syrup and Dawn liquid soap, those two would be our solutes. They are what's being dissolved into the water and the water is a solvent. In fact, it's a universal solvent. So the Petri dish in the middle, the Dawn liquid soap is gonna be our solute being dissolved into water, our solvent, and the Petri dish on the right the glycerin and the Dawn liquid soap are both solutes and the solvent in that case is still the water. And when we mix these things together, we form a solution. So take a second, see which one you think makes the very best bubble and how you could improve this lab. Do you think putting different amounts of each solute in could possibly make a bigger bubble? Let me know. Thanks for watching.